Hello and welcome back. This time we are checking out the humor of the new generation. Let's see what the best they can come up with. The girl you like, her father, her brother, her ex, her crush, and you. Wow. Wearing their pants very high. At that point, she's right. I mean, if not for the pants design, this I think this could look okay. Uh, other than that, what the hell? What the hell, people? Why do they even find Bert? Where, where do they even find these pants? Good job. Kylo Ren. <laughs> Almost normal. Kylo Ren. That's it. In the new Star Wars movies, you're actually kind of rooting for Kylo Ren. <laughs> but maybe not so much. But, like, maybe he's a redeeming factor. <laughs> what the hell, mate? Why would, you, why would you even bother with pants? Like, what the hell is problem with just, like, wearing pants normally? Kylo Ren? Respect. Respect. <laughs> Asterisk and Obelisk. I don't see these guys. Where is this from? Is this some kind of uh, cosplay? Did they have some kind of movie? I don't know. Hmm. Where are you? I'm coming, ho. <laughs> home. 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 You fucking piece of shit. <laughs> wow. Come on. You can't talk to your mom like that. <laughs> Holy shit. Top 10 photos uh, taken before <laughs> disaster. You can just show your mom that you meant well, right? You're gonna have evidence. Your life will be terminated in 30 seconds. Just say you're joking. It works every time. Advertising done right. Murder. Mom. And mom, dad? Why didn't you kill me too? Kills 99% of the germs. <laughs> Ah, <gasps> oh, nice. But also, this is smart. What's the point of killing everybody? That's just so unsatisfying. You want to kill almost everybody. Then you have a bunch of hopeless people left who's gonna tell all, for the rest of their lives how much of a badass you are. Maybe they're not gonna put it that way, but that's generally the idea behind it. <laughs> Media saying that video games can make people violent. Me restarting a game because I accidentally picked the rude, uh, rude uh, dialogue and making uh, the character sad. That's kind of like me. I decided to be a badass and what happens? I just can't do it. I can't be like an evil character. As long as if I develop some kind of connection towards my companions, I can be a total dick toward the NPCs, no problem. But even that I don't really want to do. But when it comes to my own companions, I can't, I can't be evil. I'm not gonna kill them, I'm not gonna torture them. I'm just, it just doesn't work. I can't do it, okay? God damn it. That's why I have quick save and quick load. Picking the wrong dialogue options. <laughs> Respect. A panda noticed that pregnant pandas get special treatment, so, so she copied the, the behavior of pregnant pandas to get extra bamboo. <laughs> Don't these bastards just chum on a bamboo all day long? That's what they do. They look kind of fat, but I, I guess that's their normal look. The pandas are so useless. But that, yeah, that, that's how it works. The the keepers were encouraging this behavior. So, that's like, that's like the, they rewarding it. So, makes sense. The trickster, I don't know where that picture is from. Looks like some kind of game, but I'm not familiar. Like Postman, like Son, <clears throat> my dad and I are great reminders that genetics aren't an exact science. Uh, geneticists here. There are a number of factors that go into determining a person's height. Genetics, of course, uh, plays a huge role, but other things, such as uh, diet, environment, and having a cheating whore of a mother play into the equation as well. <laughs> Is it completely out of the question that... I, it just cannot be told because I, I just I can't make that uh, conclusion because some kids just look like one parent and uh, I, I guess he just had uh, really unlucky genes, uh, this guy. So it's not, it's plausible, plausible that he's the father. But god damn it, if it doesn't look weird. It is unlikely though. 
Damn. If I was his father, I would be fucking proud. It was like, oh my god, I made a giant. Fuck yeah. I hope my son is like twice as big as me. Maybe that's not a good idea. At least a little bigger, okay? Porn actress, a turns 30. Porn industry, I diagnosed you with stepmom. <laughs> I don't get this whole shit. Like, I, I guess the whole point behind it is that people just don't give a fuck what you write in the title. And those who do actually like, oh my god, I have this, like, secret, uh, unresolved sexual attraction toward my family members, which is just wrong. I look at my sister and... No. I, I gotta go and just check out poor. But, like... Watching like brother sister porn would be wrong, so I have to watch stepsister and stepmother. Like, but, but you're still keeping inside the family. Like, it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> I don't know. What, what? What? I'm pretty sure that the porn industry does not give a fuck. You know, they just go with what works. And if people just care about that, then just uh, keep uh, providing it. Yikes. I don't know, man. But this is kind of the reason. Maybe certain individuals would be muting the videos. At least I was told. Cat is obese, dying, and can't move. Humans. Haha, <laughs> chunky boy! Take some pictures before you die! That's nice. That's what some people do. They just have a pet. Uh, give the pet unrestricted amount of food. And the pet dies. Uh, much sooner than the pet <laughs> would otherwise die. I guess not without any care, but uh, still. God damn it. Look at that. Look at the face of that cat. It, it just doesn't get too much bigger. That's why I don't really open it. That is not a face of, uh, <laughs> of satisfaction. It kind of looks like this a cat like just left Vietnam or some kind of has some kind of PTSD. <laughs> Imagine your life. Fuck, I would be like that cat too. I'm 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 adopted by these two <coughs> upstanding citizens who just feed me and I have nothing else to do other than pose with them. Uh that I don't understand but like that that takes up a lot of fucking time. God damn it. You know, you have it right, cat. Death by food. Not a bad way to go, considering. My voice in my head. My voice in real life. My voice in recordings. Damn. Just believe in yourself, mates. But I kinda understand this, although the answer is just to believe in yourself. But I do sound a little better in real life than in recordings. Maybe I would I should buy a better microphone, but it's it's kinda good enough. But it's not not really because of me, I feel like. So So Just just like me. If you sound off in the recordings, just blame it on the fucking microphone. Unless you spent the fucking fortune on it. Easy. To all you confused Europeans, Europeans, uh, this is what the Super Bowl is. <laughs> wow, that's pretty big. God damn it! Up that uh, clarify things. We can all relate to this. Wakes up. Please don't be seven a.m. Please don't be seven a.m. Clock. Four a.m. Yes. This is funnily enough kind of the other way around it for me, because I often wake up at 4 to 5 a.m. Uh, 4 is a little early, not always wake up at 4, but uh, usually 5. Uh, but sometimes at 4. And uh, if, if it was 7 a.m., I would be like, fuck me, that would be bad. <laughs> so flip it around for me. You would ask, why the hell would you wake up early? Aren't you like a night owl? Yeah, kind of, but in order to get shit done, 
you need to wake up early, and then you like, like you realize like it's like st still six six a.m. and you've done so much already, and you can just like you have a fresh head, you can learn a lot, so it's it's pretty good, it's pretty damn good. So, god damn it, you slackers, start waking up at four a.m. Although you have to go uh, to sleep uh, pretty early for that. Too depressed to go out, too bored to stay in, not poor enough to uh, free uh, to get free help, uh, not rich enough to pay for help. Welcome to the middle class, motherfucker. Welcome to bitching. Bitching ain't gonna get you ahead in life. Com complaining. Don't get me wrong. I am a poor motherfucker too, but. Bitching never once took me one step forward. So, yeah. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> but I can't help but like this uh, for uh, Filthy Frank. <laughs> so, <laughs> fuck yeah. When you find a video to eat to, finally, a worthy video. My meal will be legendary. <sighs> it was well worth uh, 20 minutes uh, looking for a video. <laughs> <laughs> I actually I kind of uh, find videos. I totally get this. This is 100% me, but I also kind of go the other way. I don't need a 20 minute video because I speed up videos uh, by quite a bit, by quite a lot. So like I don't even use that 2x uh, available on YouTube. I use uh, between like 2.2x and uh, that's usually very doable and kind of like up it based on how uh based on the video like how clearly they are talking or maybe there's like need for uh, slow it down for comedic timing but usually not so much uh 2.2 .2 is my default usually but sometimes i go up to 3.5 so in that case you can even watch like a full movie <laughs> while you're eating <laughs> but uh i wouldn't recommend it but that would be sick <laughs> anyway who were it better <laughs> stop sending me this <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Billy Eilish, what the hell? <laughs> that is hilarious. Holy shit. But when it comes to Billy Eilish, I actually like Billy Eilish. Her music is okay. I wouldn't say it's my favorite, but her music is okay. And uh her personality is okay too. Like, so this is just a good example of that not all uh teenage uh singers and musicians need to be total douchebags. Uh, they can be just normal people, and uh, that's kind of cool. So, <laughs> but god damn it, if that's not awesome, this is hilarious. Holy shit! <laughs> but but probably <laughs> yeah, like Billie Eilish, obviously, like just in on the fun. Like she she uh, herself posting this shit. <laughs> this is hilarious. <laughs> oh my god! God damn it, that outfit. Teacher, why are you late? Uh, heavy traffic. Is that my fault? Then I blame you? Whole class, shocked expression on their faces. I think it's pretty good. I think that's an acceptable answer to a stupid question. <sighs> why are you asking why am I late? Why do you even care? <laughs> oh my god. I tend to be pretty honest and direct, usually, and uh, I definitely got into uh, some trouble for that. <laughs> Once I told the teacher that I I, uh, I was late because I was just hanging out with a friend after like, uh, well, I missed my bus because of it. Well, I just like met, met with a friend, just said hi and like, fuck, I missed my bus. And she gave me so much flack for that. Same teacher. Uh, when I was sick for like three weeks, I was pretty sick, and uh, came back, and uh, she she had a beef against me. She tried to somehow uh, embarrass me for the class for uh, slacking. I was like, <laughs> so, but I didn't tell her what the hell was what was up, and but I I did tell her like one on one, like what the hell, teachers. God damn it. <laughs> you know you're dealing with people too, right?
Okay, last one. Vicious cycle indeed. Companies that make women's clothing but not adding functional pockets because of handbags. Women. <laughs> Look like a fucking present. Companies that make handbags because women clothes don't have functional pockets. Yeah, fuck that. Who, like... No. If you buy some dumb shit, like, I don't know, skirt or like some dumb... I don't know. I don't care. Like, it's dumb. You know? You know what you want to buy? We're talking about... You know, Lex here. What what do you want to buy? I'm gonna tell you the best in slot gear for Lex. It is cargo pants. They somehow get a bad rap because smear campaign, obviously. Like if if everyone knew how good cargo pants were, no one would wear anything else. You have a proper jeans that totally blocks the sun. It's good in any weather. And it has so much carry space. Amazing. And you can just uh, use it properly, even without the belt. It is amazing. It is beyond crazy that you would consider anything else. Like, even, like, I just buy, like, a regular jeans and, like, it has no pockets. It is complete garbage. Like, the regular, po even the regular pockets are so shallow. You can't, you can't put your phone in there without like oh is it gonna fall out i guess i guess we're gonna find out no it's garbage it is garbage cargo pants if you're a woman uh and you're just like shopping the women's section what the fuck are you doing you want to go to the men's section and buy some cargo pants there you go free tips for you and if you're a man and you're kind of wondering what to buy go ahead and go to the men's section what the hell you were doing in the women's section and buy some fucking cargo pants Okay, three tips for you guys, and uh, don't buy handbags or I don't know what the fuck that is. Uh, some 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 skirts. What's the point? Okay, what's the point? It do doesn't even cover you. You want cargo pants? Cargo pants covers you, easy. So, but yeah, Ryan Reynolds. God damn it! Even he's not wearing a skirt. If you needed one more evidence, there you have it. Anyway, guys, uh, that's it for now. Thanks for watching, and uh, see you next time.